Hey y'all, welcome back Braxton Boys. This is Chauncey and Conrad. So today we're going to do our maintenance for on our club car golf cart, our maintenance cart. This here, we use the crap out of. So, we're going to show you how to check the batteries. They're right underneath the seat in order to access them. Lift the seat up, lift out, set aside. Pull that thing out of here. Found you a lighter. Heck yeah. Within the golf cart back here, there's a little switch. Uh, it says run and tow. So basically, if it's in tow mode, no matter if I have it in reverse or forward, it's all in disengaged. That is the cutoff for the battery. That guy is right here. We did this not too long too long ago. Um, we're gonna check the battery output with our voltmeter. We're gonna use volts DC. Uh, remember, you're dealing with electricity here, and this is more than 12 volts. I do. Believe Follow the manufacturer's recommendations if you're uncomfortable with electricity or mechanics. Um, leave it to the professionals. Leave, leave it to the professionals. Take it to your shop. So, we're going to go to our main lines here our positive and our negative. We are currently at 50.9 volts. And that's combined for all six batteries. Mind doing that one more time so I can show the people up? Hold on, let me stop. Get this detangled. Get your hotline. Fifty point nine, that's all six batteries, that's what's going to the motor. Alright, so the next thing you want to check is your water level. You got make sure you're wearing gloves for this part. Glasses as well. And you want to make sure you're wearing safety glasses. You are dealing with uh, battery acid at this point. Once the water enters the battery and it gets energized, it turns to a battery acid. So what you end up doing is you'll pop the covers off. Sound right up in front of it so you'll know and don't lose them. It's recommended that you do use uh, that bottled water, uh, what's that called? Uh, Denate uh, fancy water. With no minerals. No minerals, no additives, just purified water. So with this, I'm taking a peek. Come on, let's take a look. Alright, so what we're doing is we're taking a look at the water levels in each and every cell. Each and every cell, we already did this probably two months ago or so, so this one here is low. You can see the cells, the fins of them starting to show. This here is a good one. You have the water above that. They are getting a little low, some of them to be topped off, but uh, this one here we're going to fill up a little. What is the name of 
that water. The nature. Usually, no, that's alcohol. <laughs> it's usually filtered through reverse osmosis. Anyways. You want to grab that water right there? This one? Yeah. All right. That went through the uh, dehu. Yeah, that's reverse osmosis. Evaporate. Evaporated water. We got fun. Uh, here or here. There it is. All right, so for this part, what you're going to need is some water and a funnel. And you want to be careful. It don't take much. Fill it up. Go ahead. This here will keep your battery from exploding on you. If done properly, yeah. and since Conrad has the water, I'm just double checking. Go ahead and fill it up a little bit more. This cell, this cell. I've actually had it where a battery I was sitting on an uh, electric car and the battery actually blew underneath the seat right underneath where I was sitting. You want to talk about making your heart jump? We are good. All right, we're going to go ahead and cap these all back up. The thing with your golf cart that you might notice is if you're driving, if you're driving and your power output seems to be cutting in and out, jerking a little bit, this is definitely one of the first things I would check. Um, I would make sure your charger your charger is plugged in properly, make sure everything's good, and then if not that, sometimes it can be the just the level in the cells, they're not charging properly because there's not the right amount of water. And they lose charge quicker as well. So are you saying that bucking bronco feeling that we usually that we get sometimes? Yeah. Can be a low charge. Yeah, I tell you to knock it off. You're like, it ain't me. Alright, now since we have all this done, we're gonna flip it back into run cycle. That engages the power. So that's how we service our batteries here. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and don't forget to ring that bell for more no for notifications when we post more videos. This is Braxton Boys. I'll see you on the next one. Later.